good morning welcome to engineering physics class today i am going to explain about the brickman technique to grow a single crystal there are different methods for growing single crystal such as solution method gel method and uh, melt method now this is a third category melt method we are going to grow single crystal using melt method so in that one it is given actually given by a scientist bridgman so it is named as bridgman technique so the principle behind this particular technique is the selective cooling of molten material selective cooling of molten material to form the single crystal that mean slowly the molten state material is going to be cooling that's why it form a solid form of crystal so we have the melt melt method that means we have the molten state material that is going to be change into solid form that is selective cooling of molten material so this, this process is going to be happen extremely in a slow manner that is selective this is principle then about the construction description part the apparatus which consist of this verticals see here this is a vertical actually cylindrical crucible made of platinum vertical cylindrical crucible this crucible nothing but a vessel in which the material is placed uh, that is going to be molten state with the help of the furnace and then it change into solid form by using the other furnace so we have two furnaces and the crucible the crucible movement is going to be controlled by pulley so the pulley system is also there okay so the apparatus consist of vertical cylindrical crucible that a crucible is actually made up of plate platinum that is platinum or it may be a quartz okay that means whose lower part is tapered is comparing the top end the lower portion is tapered so in such a way the crucible is going to be designed okay next the furnace coil actually here the furnace is uh, is actually the furnace work based on the electricity that means the induction coil so furnace coil one word is there so furnace coil winding is such that the upper zone is extremely hot and the lower zone is low temperature a pulley arrangement is there in order to move the crucible movement that is happen slowly in the downward direction so these all arrangements so see here this is one uh, furnace upper furnace this is a lower furnaces this is extremely hot this is extremely low temperature this is uh this temperature is going to be controlled by giving some external electric field that is uh, for induction furnace induction like induction stove okay then middle portion where the crucible is placed initially inside the crucible the material is kept as it is that means the material or material whose crystal structure is going to be grown is kept inside the uh, particular crucible and enter into the first furnaces upper furnaces when this crucible enter into the upper furnaces automatically the material which is available inside the crucible is going to be molten state is going to be melt so is in the form of liquid state okay so now the molten state material is there inside the crucible so it's still molten state if it is in the upper furnaces 
ओके नाउ दिस सेम क्रूसिबल इज स्लोली मूव डाउनवर्ड डायरेक्शन विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस दैट मींस पुल्ली अरेंजमेंट दिस मूवमेंट इज मूवमेंट इज एक्चुअली वन मिलीमीटर पर आवर सो एक्सट्रीमली स्मॉल मूवमेंट स्लो मूवमेंट इज देयर सो स्लोली दिस क्रूसिबल एंटर इन टू द the lower furnaces once the crucible enter into the lower that means the tapered and enter into this uh, lower that means second uh, furnaces it start to solidification that mean already the material is in the form of liquid that is going to be change into solid form slowly so this process is going to be extremely slow manner the crucible is slowly lowered from hot zone to the cold zone the movement should be in the range of 1 mm per hour so okay then as the pointed tip as the pointed tip enter into the cold zone that mean the second furnaces the melt get solid already the molten state material is going to be changed into the solid form as the crucible lower further growth is continuously going to be taken place and the large single size crystal is going to be achieved the shape is similar to the shape of the crucible so if we need the other shape other types uh, means we want to change the crucible shape so whatever the obtained uh, crystal that shape is similar to the shape of the crucible if we need different shape of the crystal or different shape the solid form of crystal we can use the different shape of crucible that is also possible so this way by this way we are able to grow the crystal structure with the help of the bridgman technique then in this technique some more advantages are there and also some few disadvantages also there so now i going i'm going to explain about the advantages so this this type is simple and also cheap that mean low cost oxidation of melt is prevented with the help of this arrangement then control of shape and size so we can get a shape a suitable shape Uh, that means solid by using different crucible the bulk gallium arsenide crystal is going to be grown with the help of this method so gallium arsenide uh, crystal is going to be grown in the large size possible with the help of this way next disadvantage some disadvantages also there growth rate is very slow as already i pointed out that this crucible is lowering in extremely slow manner whose movement is 1 mm per hour this slow process it will take more time to complete this solidification process so that is extremely slow process that is the mention here very that means the crystal perfection is also crystal perfection is also not as some still the growth is a better one growing a, a single crystal there is a formation of imperfection between the crystal atom so there is a imperfection possibilities are there so should be avoided that should be avoided then not suitable for material which decompose before melting so after complete melt then only it's going to be changed into solid form by using this technique some material which is going to be decompose during the melting itself so this technique is not suitable one for those type of material that is another one disadvantages and that don't difficult to maintain temperature gradient so already i pointed out that up to this portion the first half portion the temperature is extremely hot then the lower half portion temperature is very low that is cold temperature so this is very difficult to maintain such a, 
different temperature within this uh, range or within the uh, particular geometrical shape. So that is also belong to disadvantages. So in this video, I am going to explain about Brigman technique. This is one type of growing crystal that is given by a scientist Brigman. So by this we are able to form or grow the crystal in a perfect manner almost by melt method. So some defect, some disadvantages are there. Still it is a good one to get or achieve uh, uh, that means solid form of crystal. So by this I conclude this video. We will meet in the next video. Thank you.